We bought the Sea Eagle um, in January of uh, 2000. We were almost ready to, uh, to head out for Baja, uh, Mexico, when we decided we wanted the boat. And um, we debated about uh, a telephone and catalog order for fear that it might delay us. But I was promised uh, seven to ten days. The, um, the boat arrived right on schedule. And one of the things that really appealed to us was the fact that it broke down into pieces so that the hull, which weighs 75 pounds, was separate from the floorboard, which weighs 50. The rigidity of the floorboard was appealing. There are boats on the market that have inflatable floorboards. However, it's all one piece, and the boat becomes unmanageably heavy. The competition uh, offered um, boats that were uh, much heavier. The uh, boats with the inflatable floorboards did not appeal to us, either in terms of the way they felt or because of the excessive weight. I think probably the most memorable experiences that we've had uh, on Sea of Cortez has been uh, playing with the dolphins. The, uh, the pods of anywhere from 10 to 100 will come into the bay. And um, I'm not a person who chases wildlife, but we motor out to, um, to where they are. And if they seem to be a little bit curious and come around, we turn up the, uh, turn up the power and, and um, they swim in the bow wave and usually one um, uh, directly ahead of us. And uh, the game goes on as long as we want to play. In fact, on one occasion, I ran out of gas chasing the dolphins. The boat is solid. We have had no problems. We, um, we've, we've treated it rather roughly. We've been in, uh, in rough water, and uh, we've beached it on sand. And on occasion, I, uh, I run into rocks that I haven't seen. Um, I check the bottom, and I find uh, maybe a scuff mark here and there. But the boat has just held up exceptionally well. I think it'll last longer than I will.